2011 Ultimate Builder Custom Bike Show in Greenville, South Carolina. We're with Robbie Clausen of Camtech Custom, and he's brought a modified Harley class bike for us and a young lady. Who have you got with you today, Robbie? I've got my daughter, Bryn Clausen, with me today. Oh boy. She's helping us today. Let's take a minute and talk about your background, Robbie. Um, my name is Robbie Clausen. Um, I'm from Somerville, South Carolina. I've been building motorcycles now, working and building on motorcycles for about, I don't know, about 10 years. Um, I drag race motorcycles professionally for two years. Uh, I worked for some pretty important people in the business that I would think are really important. Um, and here we are today. What was your vision for this bike? Um, this bike has a lot of background for me. Um, I had a pretty bad past. Um, the name of this motorcycle is Rehab. Um, obviously, you can tell by the name where it came from. Um, this bike is really, my, bike, my wife bought me this motorcycle for an anniversary present, um, and I haven't stopped with it since. Um, it's a 2002 Harley-Davidson Dyna Sport. Um, I've lowered it, put wheels on it, uh, paint, motor, you name it, I've done it to it. What was your inspiration on this bike? Um, really was just to do something different. You know, you go to all these bike shows, you see all these cool bikes, but you don't ever see anybody doing anything with a Dyna or something of that nature. So I wanted to take it to the next level when we did this bike. Um, I tore this bike all the way down to the frame. Had the, We painted the frame, you know, powder coated everything that we could powder coat, diamond cut the motor. You know, the paint was just, something nobody else really seemed to like the, the colors I picked out for the paint in the beginning um, but now that it's done and uh, you can get it out in the sunlight and see it man everybody goes crazy over this thing. Let's talk about the fabrication let's start at the front of that. Um, the, with the front wheel. Front wheel is a 21 inch Heathen by Performance Machine Metzler tire PM brakes 13 inch rotors it's a stock Dyna front end, Harley Davidson fairing um, that we've added, that I added to it. Um, chin spoiler, eight inch dog bone risers, Sportster handlebars, um, stock gas tank for a Dyna, two inch lift kit. Um, it's uh, pro progressive uh, shocks, 18 inch heathen rear wheel, performance machine. Um, like I said, everything on the bike that could be powder coated or painted has been done. Um, the paint has a lot of cool tricks in it for me. Um, one would be, um, this is my other little girl, Gracie. This is her name. And then Bryn's name is on this side on the fuse box. Um, the WFO, it's how I ride everywhere I go. Um, it's just a really nice bike to me and that means a lot to me. Let's talk about the motor. What have you done on that? The motor's a 114 inch motor, uh, stage three revolution performance heads, um, four and a quarter bore revolution cylinders, stock bottom end flywheels that's been welded, trued, and lightened, uh, diamond cut cylinders and heads, uh, 662-1 cams, uh, SNS tappets, SNS push rods, SNS roller rockers, um, Barnett Scorpion clutch, five speed transmission, um, What's your two into one exhaust system? Oh, that's a Thunderheader, two into one. Has that affected your low end performance on that? Yeah, it, it, it's increased my low end performance dramatically. Um, this bike will stand up. You can ride wheelies on this bike first, second, and third gear. We talked a little about paint. Uh, anything, anything else to add on paint? Um, the paint was done by Chris Minicello at Camtech Customs where I work. Um, like I said, uh, the paint kind of come about. We got to flipping through some books. I found the color and I wanted to run with it. Um, Is that PPG again? It's all PPG paint. Um, the skulls and stuff in this bike were done by my tattoo artist, Eric Rawling, who does some graphic work for us at the shop sometimes as well. Um, the black flames kind of were like an afterthought. Um, but once we did the black flames, I wanted to go with some white pinstripe. I wanted it to really jump out at you. 
Yeah, the pinstriping really does a nice job of setting off the black flames. Thank you. What companies were instrumental in getting this bike finished? Uh, Camtech Customs was a big inspiration and big help. Um, Performance Machine, Revolution Performance, Barnett, um, Progressive, and that's, you know, that's about the... If somebody would like to get a hold of you, how would they do that? You would contact me at Robbie C at CamtechCustom.com or on the website at www.CamtechCustom.com. Robbie, thank you very much and thank you for bringing your helper. Thank you.